here. Uh, hang on. I need a minute. Okay. Can you stand up? Uh, it's okay. Take your time. Slowly. Uh, oh, it's no fucking use. No way I'm walking out of here. How did this happen, Georgie? How did it get this? Uh, It won't be your fault. Hello again. Shit. Hello, Big B. I hoped you'd come to your senses. <sighs> Crooked man's the one you want. But of course, you're too much of an idiot to see that. Or maybe you just like me too much to let me go. I'm gonna rip you to fucking pieces. Go on, then. Please, Sheriff. Haven't you done enough? Look at him. He's dying. Vivian! You can't seriously want to protect this guy. You know what he did. I'm not going anywhere. It isn't his fault. He's a murderer. Faith and Lily, he's the reason they're dead. Look, I know he made a few mistakes. We all have. What? He made sure they couldn't talk with those damn ribbons, and then he killed them. You're wearing one yourself. Doesn't that bother you even a little, knowing that man of murdered- Of course it does. Those girls- oh, So it's all my fucking fault, then. Yes, you so fucking... much. Ah! You're gonna throw me to the fucking wolf, too? You know I didn't have a goddamn choice. What the fuck? I did what I had to! You can't fucking blame me for that. You didn't have to do anything. Like hell I didn't. Look, Faith and the others tried to pull a run on us. And as you can imagine, the crooked man wasn't too thrilled. But of course, the big boss didn't want to get his fucking hands dirty. So he told me to take care of it. Either I got him dealt with. So I fucking killed him. And I'd do it again. Because it's not my fault. The crooked man gave the order. He told me to kill them, and then he fucking sold me out. <coughs> oh. <sighs> you think that'll help? No, but it's fun to do. Still haven't have you? Still the same old fucking moron. Go ahead and kill me then, but it won't bring back Lily or Faith. It won't free your friend Narissa, and I'm just the sap taking the fall for the whole thing. It must be so easy being you. Just come in here and blame me for all this shit. Job's done, right? George is the bad guy. It's all his fucking fault. But what was I supposed to do? You don't know what it's like, Bigby. How could you know? At the end of the day, you're just like him. You could have done anything else. You could have let them go. You could have freed Faith and Lily from those fucking ribbons instead of murdering them. You don't know what the fuck you're talking about. If I freed them, what would you have me do? Kill her? Georgie, don't. It was them or Vivian. So you tell me, if free Lily meant she had to die. Do you still think I had a fucking choice? What are you what? doing? I told you. What are you talking about? This is the original. The girl with the ribbon. I'm sure you've heard the stories. Couldn't take it off. Couldn't talk about it. She used her little purple ribbon to make more of them. To keep our girls quiet. To ensure absolute discretion. You promised you wouldn't. All that magic is connected to this little thing. You remove hers, and the spell's broken. They're all free. But you know what happens to her? The same thing that happened to Faith. So don't you come in here and tell me I fucked up. What the hell, Georgie? It was we one were supposed to look out for each other. I trusted you. You can't fucking blame me. You're not innocent here either. How could you do this? I thought you cared about them. I do. Of course I do. You have to understand, nobody was supposed to die. When we built this place, it, it was just a stupid idea. A gimmick. Discretion what, what is bad our guarantee. You than the other two. It started anyway. This was One life or two life, you know? Place. We were going to be in charge for once, and nobody would try to control us, or use us. That was the point. Then the crooked man showed up, and everything just turned to shit. So, do you get it now? Why I couldn't just... 
If you still think it's so fucking simple, then you do it. Go right ahead. Kill her then. What are you doing? Break the spell. Save the fucking day. Stop it. I told you. Sometimes all your options are shit. What the fuck are you supposed to do then? Don't talk about me like I'm not even here. Please. You think this is hard for you? My life is such a fucking burden on your conscience. Don't I get a say? It's my life. Like it was either of yours to give up in the first place. I wasn't really- Just shut up! Vivian, this is the way it has to be. I know that. Wait! But you're not going to be the one to do it. I'm sick of everyone thinking that they can just do what they want with my life. I thought it would be different here. But it's all the fucking same. Vivian! I didn't mean- Do you think I wanted to be this person? No. What I did to Faith and Lily? To all of them? Vivian, wait, I- Every day I have to look Gwen and Hans in the eye and pretend I don't care. I have to forget what I've done to them. What I took away from them. I look at Nerissa and I hate myself. Vivian! I can't pretend anymore. What are you doing? Vivian, Okay, it's extreme. Vivian! No! Fuck! No, 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 no! Wow. Why'd you have to do that, Vivian? Vivian! Shit! It's for the best. Now Nerissa and the others can be free. What the fuck is wrong with you? Vivian! I didn't fucking mean it! I would just... It's a bit late to do it though. You <laughs> star and save the other two. <laughs> But I guess... Ooh, it says pie in his fingers. <laughs> oh, fuck! Get up. Get up! Don't think so, Big B. Ooh. I'm gonna die here. I think we both know that. Just make sure you give the crooked man the same treatment when you find him. Really fuck him up for me, all right? He's gonna have it worse. Don't worry. Good. Old foundry by the river, all right? Shepherd Metalworks. He'll be there. Fucking asshole. You want to finish me off now? <laughs> or do you plan to kick me around a little first? Rip my limbs off one by one? That's what you want to do, right? Well, whatever it is, just get it over with. That's not who I am. Sure it's not. No more games, all right? We both know how this ends. <laughs> just make it quick. I know what I did. <laughs> All right, Georgie. <laughs> I'm only doing this because we wouldn't suffer as much. As much as he deserves it, I'm not going to be that guy. Here we go. Let's do this. Someone else is gonna die. Once we find a way in. There we go. 